in this problem, we have a group of four numbers. And we're supposed to order them from least to greatest. So put the smallest number first and then uh, up to the greatest. But we've got decimals. We've got a repeating decimal. We've got a square root. We've got uh, a fraction. So how do we go about doing this? Well, first, I'm going to look at the signs. I notice I've got three negative numbers and one positive number. So this is obviously the greatest number. Uh, any positive number is going to be greater than negative numbers. So I'll put that over there uh, on the right. And now we need to compare these three negative numbers. I think the best way to do that is use a calculator for the fraction and the, uh, and the square root. This negative 4.4 repeating, just a lot of fours. It goes on and on. I'm just going to put down a few. Uh, so that I can compare with these other uh, numbers that I come up with. And I'm just going to stack these up. I'm just going to draw an arrow, though, to remind myself which one is which. That's that one. Let's do the square root of 17. Let's see what, what that comes out to. I'm going to grab my calculator here. So 17, whoops, try that again. 17, hit the square root key. Okay, 4.123, I think maybe... Uh, three digits will be enough here. I'll go back and get more if I need to. And then let's do 47 over 11. So that's division, 47 divided by 11. And that's got 4.27 repeating. Oh, interesting. So negative 4.27. Yeah, and that is enough digits. I can tell already I'm going to be able to order these. So all of these have negative 4 to start with. And then the next digit, the tenths digit, they're different. So I notice this negative 4.44 repeating. That's got the largest sort of number part if you're ignoring the sign. But because it's negative, that means this is the smallest number of them all. So uh, you know, on a number line, here's 0, here's negative 1, here's positive 1. The, most, the smallest number is the furthest in this direction. So it's going to end up having the biggest uh, number part disregarding the sign. And that's our negative 4.4 repeating. So we'll put this one here, negative 4.4 repeating. Next up would be this one. And this was the uh, negative 47 elevenths. And this was the square root of 17. So this 2 is greater than the 1. So this is a smaller number because it's negative. So this is negative 47 elevenths. And then finally, we have our negative square root of 17, and then our 